Hello, peanut peeps. How you doing? I'm doing great. I'm sitting here on the beach. Who doesn't love the beach? The beach is awesome. And I spent the whole summer on the beach with uh, skimmers, terns, because they were having their babies here. But now it's towards the end of the season and the last batch of skimmers are still here, some juveniles, and they're skimming along the water and I'm trying to get that. And what has happened here towards the end of the season, um, there was a few storms and those storms pushed the water from the ocean up into the beach area, right on the sand here, creating these large ponds. And it's awesome because if I sit right here and I can position myself along here to get the best light with your skimmers, they'll come from the ocean and they'll skim here and then they'll go back to the ocean. So uh, I'm, tr I'm trying to get them coming right at me. And over the last few weeks, I found this is a good spot. Uh, in the afternoon when the sun's coming down, that when they're going back to the ocean, I try to get I try to get two eyes coming towards me and skimming towards me. So I'll see what I can get today. Known for its skimming, plowing the water with its lower mandible, the upper mandible snapping down immediately when contact is made with a fish. Skimmers find food by touch, not by sight. Often forages in late evening or at night when waters may be calmer and more fish may be closer to the surface. On this warm day in September, I think this juvenile is more interested in having fun and getting wet then for looking for food. This youngster appears to be practicing skimming right on the land. There are three species of skimmer in the world. The black skimmer is the only skimmer found in the Americas. The whole summer I was here, I didn't see any spotted lantern flies. But today I saw quite a few on the beach here. So I don't know. I don't know. And they're, they're, that's a tough bug. One just landed right here on my hat right here. They have quite a few folk names in North America, where it has been called Scissorbill, Shearwater, Sea Dog, Floodgull, Stormgull, Razorbill, and Cutwater.